Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name's Lucinda, this is Yellow Chic Road. Thank you for clicking on the video today. Um, I just wanted to say, I know we're all having a really, really tricky time presently in these really uncertain, awful times. Nobody seems to be in a great mood um, considering everything that we have enjoyable in our lives has kind of been put at a screeching halt when we'll uh, really do anything that we usually do to perk ourselves up, to get with friends, to go out for dinner or do any of those things. But I just wanted to make this channel as normal as possible and to just keep providing you guys with some, you know, fun content and just a little bit of escapism never hurt anybody. Um, and this is what I wanted to provide with for you today. Um, so with that said, I thought I'd do a little bag comparison of my recently purchased small vanity um, with chain, with classic chain, um, because I thought it would be a really good little battle with the um, classic, well, it's not a classic, it's not a double flap, with the mini square. This little guy is often very coveted. Um, I did see in my local store they still had a couple um, from this latest collection, the 20S. So they are certainly still very sought after bags and I thought this would be a really great little comparison. So let's jump right in, but before we do, please make sure you like and subscribe. Click the bell so you get notified for future videos. Mm -hmm. So between the two, we will compare not only size, but what they fit. We'll compare pricing and we'll, I'll definitely um, show you mod shots so you can see how they sit on the body because we'll also measure the strap length because I think that's always important about how they're gonna sit on the body. So we'll zoom in for the comparisons. So as you can probably see from them sitting side by side, they're very similar in their um, length. So if I was to sort of put them in front of each other, you can probably see that they're actually exactly the same length. So they're both 17 centimeters in length, which is approximately, I think, 6.6 .6 inches, give or take. Um, and then from the width, again, fairly similar. You have, uh, let's just get the tape measure eight centimeters and I think they're both eight centimeters which is kind of wild yeah they're both definitely eight centimeters and then in height is sort of where it differs because the mini square or baby square whatever you kind of prefer to call it is uh, more like 12 and a half centimeters versus I think that's about 10 uh, so on the website, they've got this listed at nine and a half centimeters high and then this guy here at 13 and a half. So I must have just, yeah, it's definitely 12 and a half, but you will get variations with the mini square um, through the seasons. They might vary in strap length and proportion. So I thought we will start with the strap length because I think that makes a difference. So with the mini square, you have a strap drop of 52 centimeters, which is 20 and a half inches. Yeah, so. And with the vanity, it is, so this is slightly longer at 54 centimeters, which is about 21 and a quarter inch. So you've got a little bit more length in the small vanity versus the mini square. Now I thought I would play with what fits in this guy and then see if it also fits in the mini square because for those that watched the unboxing that I did of this guy, you can actually fit quite a remarkable amount of items inside. So let's play with that. 
So as you can see, you've got a nice open interior, you've got a little lipstick holder, and you've got card um, slots here as well. So I think firstly, we will put in our iPhone 10. You can put your pochette clay. So I might just stand that up there. This is a zip card purse. We can obviously utilize the lipstick holder. And look, that is full, but you could probably fit another card holder, or if you've got a little hand sanitizer or something small, you can also fit something else down the side there. Um, maybe I can even put, this is a little coin purse. Oh, nope. Oh, yep. Apparently, all of that can fit in there just nicely. And we'll zip it up. All well contained. And so let's double check that all of this will then fit into the mini square. So mini square, you have a leather interior. It's, you might be able to find it a bit hard to have a look in there, but it's quite dark. So first, let's start with the phone. We will put the pochette clay inside. We'll put the zippy card wallet. We'll put the lipstick. Now, I don't think our card holder is gonna really... Look, that is at a pinch. So I hope you can see all that in there. That's definitely kind of <laughs> all lined up in a row, nice and tightly in there. And then the lucky last item that I threw in at the end there was my little coin purse and that will just have to sit on top. And will that do up? Oh, you know what? It won't guys. So no coin purse, but the rest of it does up. So isn't that interesting? Who would have thought that between these two, the small vanity with chain would actually fit more? Quite impressive. So let's discuss all important pricing. So the little mini square presently retails for 4,560 Australian dollars. And the small vanity with classic chain is 2,440 Australian dollars. So there is quite a difference in price. So by to the tune of like 2,100, which is substantial, but let's be fair and fair is fair. Um, the chain, while the chain on this guy is really beautiful on the vanity, but you've got a thickness difference, substantial thickness difference. Hope you can see that. You obviously have um, a flap and a clasp here. You have a pocket at the back. So there's little elements that are certainly um, warrant making this one more expensive, of course. But that's not to say this is still a really reasonable price as far as Chanel goes. And specifically, let's just say it fits everything like one would need to carry. So the capacity of this is just so impressive. The bag is so beautiful. It's to me, this is timeless and classic, just like this guy. So if you can get your hands on one of these, I strongly recommend doing so. Um, I know a lot of people are trying to get their hands on it. I was very fortunate to be able to race into the store as soon as it landed. Sometimes it just boils down to timing. Um, so I will include mod shots. You can see both of these on the body, but I would love to hear your thoughts.
So everyone, thank you for watching today. Let me know what you've been doing to pass some time. Um, I think we all need to keep positive and support each other through this time. And I would love to know what your thoughts are. Does anybody out there own the mini square and consider buying the small vanity bag as well? Would love to hear your thoughts. Please like and subscribe before you leave. Look forward to seeing my next video. Bye guys.